Hello and welcome to Bat Magic Let's Play. Today, well, you'll see what we're gonna do. Meanwhile, on a planet far, far from Earth. Raditz, the bastard went and got himself killed. He always was an embarrassment. Still, I must admit, I'm very interested in these Dragon Balls. So they're capable of granting any wish? All right, let's go. We're gonna bring Raditz back from the dead? Don't make me laugh. We have no more use for that dead weight. We could wish for eternal youth, for immortality. Can you imagine it? Nothing could possibly stand in our way. Sounds good to me. Count me in! Invigorated by the prospect of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. The dangerous duo begins to make their way to Earth. Meanwhile, Goku, have died in battle against Raditz, stood alongside Kami at the entrance to the other world. And that is why I brought him here as he is, to be trained further. Therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama, I humbly ask that you allow him to meet with King Kai. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000-mile-long snake way so he can meet King Kai. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King Kai, then I suggest you be on your way. However, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully, other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes, we've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly, <laughs> but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position above that of the Earth's Guardian. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. Of course I'm strong! But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need brains to do this kind of managerial work. Mana, mana what work? Now then, to help you better understand my work, let's give you a little quiz. Uh, well, um, actually kind of in a hurry. <laughs> well then, Quiz time. if that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you don't need to see King Kai. Oh, what? No way! Okay, okay, I'll take the quiz. Why didn't you say that from the beginning? Anyway, let's begin. I'll let you through if you can answer all of my questions correctly. That's right. He made a mess of enough planets to earn himself a place in hell. In fact, he's one of the biggest pains we've ever had to deal with. Right, next question. Correct, of course I am. I am much more powerful. Isn't that right, Kami? Ah, yes, King Yama. You are more powerful. Right. Next question. Yeah. 
That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come here. Like your brother. He wasn't an earthling. Next question. Is there a way to bring... Yes! Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky Dragon Balls are indeed how you do it. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? <laughs> Care to shed some light on that, Kami? <laughs> oh, uh, Ginyama, I... Uh... Whatever. Moving on. Which question is this? Sorry, but that's incorrect. Huh? What? This is the fifth question, right? Really? Um, one, two, three. Hmm. Of course it was. I, I was just testing you. <laughs> and you oh. passed the test. Well, that was the true fifth question. There's that trademark denial of his. Hmm. I heard that, Kami. Maybe I'll send you to hell when it's your time. Oh, please forgive me, your highness. Boy, he's got one hell of a sense of hearing. <laughs> oh, you think you're some sort of funny man. <laughs> That's enough of all this. I will allow you to see King Kai. Wow, really? Thanks a bunch, Mr. Yemma. Don't tell me you've forgotten who you're talking to. No, 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 Mr. I'm King Yemma. I haven't. <laughs> That's more like it. If you're going to see King Kai, then go. Well, this is where we part ways. Good luck, Goku. Thanks. I'm not really sure what to expect. But I'm pumped to meet this King Kai guy. Oh, nice. I mean, my do. Time to wake up, kid. You've slept long enough. Huh? Who, who are you? Listen up. Time for a reality check. Your daddy is dead, okay? He sacrificed himself to kill the man who kidnapped you, in case you forgot. If his friends are vigilant and able to find the Dragon Balls, they can bring him back. However, we've got other things to deal with. Though we were able to defeat Raditz, it sounds like we've got two of his buddies to worry about a year from now. If that's really the case, your father and I probably aren't going to be enough to take these guys down. We need power. Your power. You're going to have to learn to fight and defend the Earth. Hmm. Gohan's Crash Course in Survival. But, but I, 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 I'm no, I'm no good at fighting. Quit your whining. Once I'm done whipping you into shape, you'll be tough enough for anything. Got it? So, you, you're gonna train me? Okay, w what do I have to do? You have to live out here on your own, without distraction. I'm giving you six months. 
If you're able to survive for that long, I'll teach you how to fight. See ya. Let's assign those to the board that we just got. No. Be right back. Hungry. I, I'm hungry. I think I might be hungry. This place gives me the creeps. Twerp? Didn't go and get himself killed already, did he? Peglo specialty cannon. Let's head over to Gohan. Huh. Looks like one massive tree. This tree has been here a long time. Ah, oh, Demon King Piccolo picture. Is prepared, just wasting my time at this point. 
No, not this way. <laughs> Looks like someone wants to die. What the hell are those things? That kid's probably got his hands full right now. Guess I'll have to take care of them myself. Looks like someone wants to die. Hmm. Looks like someone wants to die. these things are there. Trash like this is a waste of my time. Just one more to go. Yeah! 
There, done. Now then, time to check on that little rug rat. Hopefully throwing him to the wolves toughened him up. I'm hungry. I'm so hungry! Little brat. We still don't have what it takes to fight the Saiyans. His latent power is our only shot. <laughs> Fine. Just this once, I'll throw him a bone. <laughs> Looks like there's only apples to eat around here. Oh well. giving me a real headache. Did I already uh. search this place? Hmm. <laughs> Looks like someone wants to die. This little brat's giving me a real headache. Search this place. Now, where can I find some? Okay. Search this place. <laughs> One's probably not enough. This little brat's giving me a real headache. Someone wants to die. Maybe there's some around here. That'll do. Hmm. Looks like someone wants to die. Maybe there's some around here.
Now where can I find some? Can I find some? <laughs> Did I already search this place? Look what I found. Found it. All right, this is all he's getting. <laughs> I'm just wasting my time at this point. Too far from my target. This kid's proving to be a real pain in my neck. Nighttime, at least. Oh, it's the moon. Whoa, it's so big and round. This is the first time I've seen a full moon. Uh oh. What the? Uh oh. <laughs> Great ape. Transform into this thing. Huh? 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 Special beam, special beam, special beam. Trying to reason with them at this point. Dear Tom, damn it! Special beam? Unbelievable! Attacks aren't doing anything! Special beam cannon! Special 
Your beam cannon's enough, you little brat! Try this! Your beam cannon! There won't be any Earth to protect if this keeps up! We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. That's right! The full moon! way to get the moon back is pull his tail off. Who would have imagined a kid had such a transformation in him? Must be a Saiyan blood. Looks like he needs a full moon and that tail of his to transform. Better get rid of it now. Now that that's taken care of, here's some clothes and a sword. I've got my own training to get to, so you're on your own again. If you can somehow manage to survive the next six months, then you will have earned the honor of being trained by the great Piccolo. You're gonna wish you'd never been born when I'm done with you. Hope you're ready. Okay, that will be it for this episode. Please like, comment, subscribe, and share for more videos. Until next time, farewell.